Yeah, instead of proof of insurance, Mag Pathology Lab sent a letter letting County Judge Parrish know they won't renew its contract come September 30th, which means Commissioner's Court will start searching for their next medical examiner. So we sincerely hope that the next medical examiner will have the full support of all county commissioners and the community. Just hours after a county commissioner meeting which discussed NAG Pathology's insurance policy, this letter was sent to the county judge. Saying NAG Pathology Labs will not renew their contract, which puts them in charge of the medical examiner's office. The county requires insurance for all county subcontractors. That way the county isn't liable. Here we are, no insurance. Um, you know, okay. A week later, still no insurance. I said, all right, well, it's going on the agenda. We need to review that contract. As of now, they still haven't provided a copy of their insurance. Corley questions if they ever had it. I, I'm doubtful at this point and very concerned. I do know that there's been a lot of controversy involving uh, this particular contract. The controversy revolves around several allegations saying NAG pathology harvested children's organs for further testing in California, all done without parents' permission. Those allegations are currently being investigated by the Texas Rangers. I think going forward, I think that this is probably uh, best for both parties. Uh, for both uh, NAG and certainly for the county as well. The company has until the end of this week to provide proof of insurance to the commissioner's court. Commissioners say if they don't get the proof of insurance, they will take the next possible steps they can. If you'd like to see the full letter, you can read a copy of it on our website, everythinglubbock.com.